everyone, how are you? Welcome to the video. My name is Owen Fox and I want to make a video today about how to attract a high vibrational partner um, of so much love, peace, joy, light and connection. What I want to say to how you do this is you have to make yourself a high vibrational person and let's um, take away the word high and say higher. Uh, so that's your main focus to become higher today or this month than last month or yesterday. How do you become a higher vibrational person? You have to heal yourself and face yourself. Feel yourself, your, 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 your wounds, your emotions, accept and your thoughts, uh, dirty thoughts, uh, rude thoughts, angry thoughts, angry feelings, surprising things you think are unspiritual. So don't be suppressing or judging yourself, but fully embrace all aspects of yourself, mental, emotional, physical, spiritual, sexual, creative. Don't deny yourself, yet I'm not saying abandon yourself, live a, with a with wild, reckless abandonment either. Take responsibility, take accountability for your life. Okay, next step, and this is all part of the, kind of the same step of raising your vibration and pure. So the next step, or this step, is purifying your energy. Purify yourself physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually. So look to purify, improve, lighten, less dense your diet, for example. Um, take I'd highly recommend a raw vegan diet, but that's not absolutely essential, but I really would overall recommend that. It helps. And distilled water, learn about Orin, or Orin, also publicly called by a very low, pretty low vibrational name, Urine, which is a deliberate name at something that's amazing, beautiful, freeing, cleansing and liberating and raise your vibration heals, strengthens, purifies energetically, physically, and even mentally, emotionally, of course. So, I'll post a video link above for this. Watch two or these two, two or three documentaries I'll post, okay? So, okay, how, what does life, what happens in life for you to become a higher vibrational person? Okay, your higher self will put you in people, um, places, things, environments, which will challenge you and expand you and force you to face yourself, your, your unpurified, dense, unhealed, suppressed parts. It's going to be hard sometimes, it's going to be tricky, challenging, confusing, sometimes you'll feel lost and the objective of this is for you to grow and to go on to the next stage, the next level in your evolution and growth. So, you have to face your challenges head on with courage, with an intention for your highest good and growth. So I'd pray for my highest good and growth. That's what I do personally. So you may want to drop things that aren't healthy or self-loving or self-nurturing. It could be environments like places or workplace. It could be jobs. It could be things, habits, or it could be any things whatsoever, um, objects, um, food, things, places. Environments, as I said, and also people, of course. So, uh, man, my arm is getting super tired. Okay, so I think I'm more or less finished the video. Um, you know, some relationships are brought on soul contracts, many of them are, and they're for us to learn by. And sometimes it can take three years to learn a lesson, or four, or five, or ten, or fifteen, or twenty, or what or one could be a friendship. So we do learn different things, many, many things in different timings. So there are seasons in our life. And uh, there's five cent. So I highly recommend praying and asking and attending your higher nature, your highest good or and and or the universe for help with your lessons and expansion and growth so you can move on to a higher frequency and a higher step in your evolutionary ladder and absolutely as you go along you will be generally um, 
raising your vibration and sometimes you can have a lovely relationship but it's more for fun and another time you can have a hard lessened soul contract which is much tougher and um, you might be less suited than a previous relationship even though you think you've grown in your spiritual journey but this exact thing serves as a tool for you to go even further in your spiritual journey by practicing all the things that you've taught you've learned now as a spiritual person if that makes sense so you think you're spiritual <laughs> you think you've woken up or waking up you think you're all spiritual now then you get a soul contract lesson and it's tough and um, it, it makes you become an expert and deepen as a human being as a divine being and to awaken even more and to become purified even more and to become much 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 deeper yeah so that's all i really want to say and i'm sure that makes a lot of sense and i say this with the highest intention to help you in your journey and path on your spiritual journey here on earth and as a multi-density multi-dimensional divine being of light love and peace so be courageous face life head on pray and ask for more 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 joy love light higher positive energy and vibrations to share to give and receive and to create so thanks for watching send you love and light peace hugs kindness and warmth and I thank you for your support I ask you to share this video and um, leave me any comments of gratitude and um, if you want one-to-one -one coaching I do 55% off my my rates at the moment for spiritual holistic and um, life coaching of body mind and spirit my intention is purely to help you move on to the next level of your life and to circumvent to go above and beyond the challenges now or the limitations now to go on to the next step of your ladder to be happier better in all ways is next level big time good when that happens um, I'm looking at my herb shop inspired below higherselfherbs.com it's 20% off first time subscribers to my mailing list so you can get lots of things try them out and you get 20% off the more you get the more you get off or you can just simply get one or two things or whatever um, and of course my new book emotional mastery and I have another previous book awakening the enlightened heart so um, I do love my new book and I do and I like my first book so <laughs> okay see you again and thanks for your love and support and have a fantastic day Okay, bye now.